Comedian, actress, and writer Zainab Johnson can be seen on the series Upload, 100 Humans, and more. And now she's releasing her debut special, Hijab Zab. The very talented stand-up is tackling subjects from her identity to dating to growing up in Harlem as one of 13 kids. And nothing is off limits. Take a look. Zainab is a very popular Arabic name. At the airport, they might look at Zainab and be like, oh, should we stop her? Johnson? Oh, no, she's probably just going to Atlanta. My parents had 13 Muslim kids. We have a stripper. She strips fully dressed, because you know we Muslim. I was on a date with a guy. He said, what, you think I'm a roofie you? I said, yeah, because that sounds like something a roofier would say. <laughs> oh boy, and Zainab joins us now. Welcome. Thank you for having me. We're Thanks so excited here. that you're here. This is your first hour special. How are you feeling now that it's done and almost out for the world? Um, I actually feel amazing. Like, I'm really proud of it, and I feel like it tells, like, a story about me. And I just, I mean, I'm an artist, you know, so I'm sensitive about mm -hmm. my stuff. <laughs> but I'm super excited. I can't wait for the world to see it. Now, it was filmed in the round, which you've done before. Yes. Why did you want to film it there, and what did it add to the experience? Um, I, I wanted to give the closest um, experience to what it's like watching a comedian in a comedy club you know mm -hmm. if you watch the special you'll see that I'm delivering material and sometimes you can only see like the side of my face or even the back of my head is very voyeuristic and I feel like that's what happened in, happens in a comedy club you know like there's people who are in the back like oh I want to see it and I can't and I just wanted to like you know I wanted to like give that feeling. Mm -hmm. Also, the round is cool. Like, <laughs> the round keeps us three-dimensional, you know? Yeah. It's not a flat background. So. Right, and you reference yeah. people's eye lines at different times. Yes. <laughs> and, yes. Uh, um, that was a very funny story. We don't want to give too much away. But uh, being that you were one of 13 kids, were you always the funny one, or did you have to be? <laughs> You know, you know, so, so, so funny. The first time I ever did a TV appearance, my mother and some of my siblings came to the taping, and my younger brother was like, I was so scared, like this, the scaredest I've ever been in my life. And I was like, why? He was like, because I don't ever remember you being funny. <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, okay. So I think that I've always been like the serious kid. Interesting. You know, but somehow I can make, Strangers laugh. I mean, you probably make your family laugh too at this point, no? I do, but they yeah. all think they're funnier than me. Mm -hmm. Oh, so we need a 13 way That's comedy funny. special. Yeah. Way of saying. <laughs> now, people may not know this, but you actually have a degree in education and math, and yes. you were a teacher. I was a teacher so, in New York City. Yeah. And you were a New York City yeah. teacher. So, how did you make this shift and why? Um, I mean, I only moved to L.A. because my best friend at the time was moving, and she was like, I'm going to be famous, and I was like, I guess I got to be famous with her. <laughs> um, and I think that I knew that I didn't want to teach. I was, I, was in, I was in a classroom, in a fifth-grade classroom, um, and they were great. They were like magnet kids, they, and they were doing everything perfectly. And then I had an epiphany, like, oh, I'm not supposed to be here. You know, most people, it's like when it's the most chaotic and it's like, yeah. oh, okay, a kid was stabbing me with a pencil and <laughs> I knew I had to get out of there. It was like perfect. And so therefore it was like quiet. And then I got like the message like, no, there's something else out there for you. Mm. I didn't know what at the time, but I knew it wasn't that. Well, now we know it's a lot of different things. <laughs> but if your students could see you now, what do you think they would say about your teaching style and about what you're doing now? Um, if my kids could see me now, they'd probably be like, we knew it. Like, I feel like I was a cool teacher. <laughs> yeah. You were probably a funny teacher. Yeah, too. I was probably cool and funny. And you know, kid, like, I was so young. You kept it real. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know, kids think that you're their age, you know. I yeah. remember asking my kids, like, how old do you think I am? And they were like, 17. And I was like, I've got to be you. old enough to teach you. You, you still look 17. You still do we, look 17. You know the jokes don't end. We're very excited for you. In fact, you can catch Zainab Johnson, Hijabs Off, on Prime Video, excuse me, Hijabs Off, on uh, Prime Video Tuesday, October 24th. Thank you so much.